You probably already know that several Line 6 products can be used as recording interfaces with Propellerhead Record. But you may not know about a bonus feature when using any of the Line 6 Pod Studio interfaces or TonePort UX8 interface with Record. You can actually use Pod Farm Standalone at the same time as Record, enjoying near zero latency tone direct monitoring through Pod Farm while recording the Pod Farm tone or your dry signal or both in Record. I'm going to set up a recording with two audio tracks that will both record my guitar at the same time. One track will record the processed pod farm signal, and the other track will record the dry signal. Since I'll be monitoring my guitar through pod farm, I'm going to set monitoring in record to external to avoid double monitoring my guitar. In pod farm, I've already got a tone I like. Now I'm going to open the mixer in pod farm and make sure that record sends one and two are sending the processed signal and that record sends three and four are sending my dry signal. A mono input is selected by default, but in case I might choose a pod farm tone with chorus or other stereo effects, I'll switch this to stereo. I'll also switch to a stereo input on audio track two so that any insert effects I add later will auto route in stereo. And I'll select UX1 inputs three and four to record my dry signal on track two. I'll take a moment to check my tuning using Record's built-in tuner. Make sure both tracks are armed for recording. Make sure I'm starting at bar one. Playing back, if I mute track 2, you can hear that track 1 has captured the processed signal from Pod Farm. And if I mute track 1 and play track 2, you can hear that track 2 contains my dry signal. I'm going to expand Audio Track 2's rack device, click Show Insert Effects, and insert a Line 6 amp device to process the dry signal. I can select from the presets that come with Record, or I can also load Pod Farm tones into Record's Line 6 amp device. All I have to do is navigate to the folder on my hard drive where the Pod Farm patches are stored. Since I can have Pod Farm and Record open at the same time, I can even edit a tone in Pod Farm, save it, and then open the new patch in Record. Record comes with a few amp and cabinet models built in. Pod Studio GX, UX1, UX2, and KP37 all add extra amp, cabinet, and preamp models to Record. And if you want to add more models, you can purchase additional model packs from Line6.com. No need to purchase additional model packs for Toneport UX8. It comes with Pod Farm Platinum, giving you the complete range of Line 6 amp, cabinet, preamp, and effects models. The last thing I want to mention is that the near zero latency monitoring in Pod Farm is not just for guitar and bass. It's also very useful for tracking vocals so that the vocalist can hear reverb and other effects while being recorded dry. And it's also great when tracking acoustic instruments. That's all for now. Until next time.